Hey, Soft Bugs, this is Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and I definitely hope to sing for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Much love to you. And for my returning subs, my extended family, thank you so much for the love and blessings that you send me each and every day. It's so greatly appreciated. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you for me helping you, for you helping me. So that is greatly appreciated. So for that being said, much love, namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings again to come for all. And if you have been watching my channel for a while and watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you are comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line. I would love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback that you want to give me about the video or just, you know, just tell me about your gift or just your experience on being a hail cut. It'll be greatly appreciated. Or if you feel like you enjoy what I heard, what you heard coming from me and you, you know, spread the word. Give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. Greatly be, be appreciated too. So thank you for stopping by my channel and, you know, showing the love. And today I'm listening to 417 Hertz, healing music, letting go of mental blockages. Uh, remove negative energy and ancient frequency music and today my video is about twin flame 101 don't worry the universe has got your back yes don't worry the universe has got your back there's just like just the video I just finished um y'all don't know how bad like the last couple of days <laughs> I've been contemplating about doing this video I really have because worrying about you know disrespecting people or rubbing somebody the wrong way and it was just something that it had to be told and it was just like i don't really want to do that video <laughs> i really didn't because i tell y'all real quick if i'm not sure about something i'm not going to speak upon it or if i'm not comfortable about it i'm not going to speak upon it but there's like a couple of times i can put on one hand there's stuff that i did not want to open up then i feel vulnerable doing that and it's just okay to feel vulnerable but you have to have that confidence in yourself that know that you know the message is going to come across not everybody is going to agree with what i say and i understand that and everybody's not going to go for what i say i also understand that too but when a message has to come out i have to be just like you know you can't be worried about you know if you know you're coming from the kindness of your heart then the right people you know, you know, they don't touch the right people. So I had to really start thinking about that. And I was just like, you know what? The universe got your back. If you know you're doing positive things and you might feel iffy about doing them, go ahead and step out on that faith anyway. Because there's sometimes when you do that, we, you know, if we don't, we don't see it, if we're not touching it and able to feel it, we, you know, you'll, you'll miss out on that silver lining that, you know, when we doubt it. So it's just like when you're feeling a certain way, find that confidence in yourself and just go ahead and do what you need to do. I'm serious because we will get down and do that and it's just like you know I feel a lot better because I got that off of my chest because it, it, it just got to the point where it started making me really emotional. And it's like people that are close to me they know I'm just like I can't take this. This is just too much. You know I don't know anything about these people but yet they're they're gravitating towards me from some kind of reason. You know, I'm seeing these things and I'm, you know, I'm not, I don't want people thinking, oh, she's trying to get attention or oh, she's lying. You know, that's not something I'm trying to do. Because if that was the case, I would put that straight in the, you know, in the description box, the, the title. That's what I didn't do. It's just, you know, what it was just like with all this, uh, the ascension and the awakening and the kundalini that you're going through on top of the shift. <laughs> on the top of this ship that's going on with the, you know, the, what is it, the full moon, the eclipse and all this stuff. So it's just like, I feel like my senses are on hyper, hyperdrive, my gift then got upgraded, and I didn't even get a letter in mail to even tell me I was going to have all this stuff going on. <laughs> really, I was just like, dang, you want to even send me a letter in the mail to let me know. These, you know, have a surgeon general thing to these, these things that we're going through. We don't. It don't have no caution sign to it. We're just going through it. And it's just some people might be able to go through it through a breeze. Because they might have not they don't they might not have a lot of things that they need to remove during their lives or 
you know, heal from. That's a blessing. If you're one of those type of people, God bless you. But some of us is dealing with a lot of stuff. Some of us is dealing with a lot of stuff. And I, I know I, I can truly say I'm one of them. Because y'all, y'all don't know. It's just like, you know, if I haven't been, you know, to your, your channel yet, please forgive me. I've been just dealing with a lot. I really have been emotionally and mentally. You know, I push out these videos for y'all. I try to stay the positive beacon all the time. I try to, but it's just to get tired. The sister get tired because I'm telling you between the people that are close to me I'll be reaching out to them because that they're going to affect me really bad and I, I try to help them fix that mess really quick because I, I'm dealing with my own stuff I can't I don't have enough time to be dealing with yours too <laughs> not on that level I don't mind helping out anybody but when I start feeling your convictions on myself whew, something got to draw the line so it's just, I know that going through all this situation, I know there's a purpose behind everything I'm going through. I mean, I'm kind of like right now, I'm fighting the headache of my life. You know, I done took medicine and I'm still, you know, feeling like somebody just gonna vouch me in the head. But it's just know that when you're going through these situations, have that confidence in yourself, have that strength in yourself, and most, <laughs> most important, have that trust and faith in the universe that they got your back. You know, I have to constantly tell myself that, especially when I'm putting out these videos, because there there can be some people that can be very rude. There can be some people that can be very hurtful. And they do cyberbullying and stuff like that. So it's just like, you know, that deals with a lot, especially when you're trying to push out energy that's positive. You, you know, you're trying to come from the heart. Because I just felt like, you know, when I did my other videos, it's just like, you know, I don't never get nervous, but it was just about that situation I just didn't really talk about. But it was just like, if you know, it, I, I just kept on hearing, if you know you're coming from a positive place, then you have nothing to worry about. If you know you're trying to be vindictive about some stuff, or you're trying to come from a bad place, you know, especially us in the back, you're going to seek that out. But the, I think the most thing you're going to probably feel is just me being uncomfortable. Because it's like, it's hard to be wobbled like that, you know, because people sometimes do not, you know, I, I love y'all, but there are some people that can be unsupportive about stuff like that. <laughs> but it's just like when people need to have, need to have that knowledge instilled to them, when their spirit is coming by, that, that people need to have their heart healed about certain things that they do not understand. I have no problem with helping if I can, if there's some kind of way I can help, especially about somebody I really don't know about, I don't mind doing that. But it's just, you know, with something so fresh like this, and it still, you know, it still makes people up in their feelings about this situation. You know, that's hard. But it's just like, I had to keep telling myself, you know, the same time it's going to be worried about, you know, what, how people feel about that. If you know you're not disrespecting anybody, you know, you're coming from a positive place. You, you don't know what kind of movement you can make. You don't know. I mean, there's just, and it's just sad that, you know, it takes stuff like this to have to happen for us to be able to wake up and realize that, you know, there's a lot more things that's more important about them than the things that we probably focus on a lot. So that's the reason why most of the stuff this, these times, things like this happen for reasons like that because we tend to get focused on the wrong things. We tend to get wrapped up in the wrong things. And it usually has to take a wake-up call for things like this to happen. So I'm over overly hoping that somebody was able to resonate with my video today. So I, uh, you know, hopefully you were able to resonate with the video. I'm so sorry, y'all. I got the headache. But, you know, I, I just go ahead and press the video out, video out as much as I possibly can because I know people need to hear them and somebody might need to hear something out of this video who will probably be able to validate or resonate with it. So if you can drop a line, like and subscribe, hit me up, I'll love a chance to hear from you. Keep me in my, your prayers and I'll definitely do the same thing for you. So now as much love and positivity as possible. I actually said that without getting my tongue tied. Ooh, Jesus.
I'm going to take the wheel. But anyway, <laughs> I will see y'all later on my next video. So now as much love and light as possible. Namaste to you big time. And I will see you on my next video. Stay blessed. Stay prosperous. I know y'all ready for this weekend because Lord knows I'm definitely ready for it too. So I will talk to you later. Peace. <laughs> wow.